My name is Gaurav Raj. Today I am going to talk about how D365 Business Center is a perfect fit for the organizations operating from different countries, from different entities and even using different Microsoft 365 and Azure AD tenants and domains. It's a common scenario and a requirement in a global organization where their local offices are operating in different localized instances, entities and domains. In such a scenario where ERP system needs to cater to the intercompany transactions well along with the ability to run consolidation and have a unified KPIs view which runs across the entities and instances. D65 Business Central is a perfect fit in such a setup. Users can create intercompany sales and purchase orders and general transactions in the system which can get auto-created in the IC Trade Partner entity within Business Central as a purchase order and a sale order respectively. The second requirement in a multi-entity environment is a general ledger consolidation which can be achieved by creating an additional company in Business Central. Moreover, we can create multiple consolidation companies which could be in different currencies or else a subset of a larger set of companies within Business Central. The third is more of an advanced feature added in the recent versions of Business Central and this is called Company Hub. No matter you have set up intercompany and consolidation features, this feature provides a unified view of the list of companies and their KPIs like overdue invoices, cash balances and tasks. This is quite useful for users in a multi-country and multi-entity setup and for the external accountants who are supposed to work for a multi-client using Business Central. Company Hub can have companies' data pertaining to different Business Central environments, either in the same tenant or in another uh, tenant environment. Please connect with Olitech to know more how Business Central can help you in a multi-company setup. Thanks. This, this is God of Watch.